This week, the Lightning get a look at the future of the franchise as they host a two-day prospect showcase in Brandon. Then they'll travel to Raleigh, North Carolina for a round-robin tournament this weekend. Our Kevin Lewis caught up with some Bolts hopefuls as they try to impress the Tampa Bay coaching staff. The Lightning have established a consistent winning culture over the past three seasons, and prospects know exactly what's expected of them the moment they hit the ice in a Tampa Bay sweater. You see it around the room with the players they've had here, the, the success they've had in the last you know, five, five years is, is pretty special, and um, you know, just getting the chance to be a part of this organization is pretty cool. Jack Thompson's been busy on the ice, helping Team Canada win a gold medal at the World Junior Championships last month. So it's nice to get some downtime to work on his fallback sport. I played golf with Dex actually, uh, Declan Carlisle, two days ago, and uh, he's a good player. But I did beat him. Oh, he did beat me. I was kind of sandbagging him a little at first. I didn't want him to expect too much out of me early. Uh, we had nothing to do that day in Syracuse, so we just decided to hit the course, and it was a lot of fun. Goaltender Jack LaFontaine says he's trying to do the little things right, focusing on the technical part of his game so he can earn a spot at the highest level. I'm a big believer in that pressure breeds success. Pressure is what you know breeds the best players in the world. So to be a part of this camp is obviously a huge privilege and to compete at the highest level, especially with this organization, is, is a treat. If LaFontaine's mask looks well, a little like a hurricane's mask, it's because the 24-year-old was originally drafted by Carolina and his new mask maker had a slight wardrobe malfunction. Usually I'm a medium and they accidentally sent a large, so it's going to be a little bit longer, so I think I'm going to be rolling into Carolina wearing this, which should be uh, a little bit funny, but uh, nonetheless, the mask is, uh, it's got good juju, so I'm not complaining about it. In Brandon, I'm Kevin Lewis, ABC Action News.